was working actually in a, uh, being a postman on Saturdays, uh, which during the winter uh, we didn't play on Saturdays, and so uh, I was I was going to school all from Monday to Friday, and on Saturday I was up about five o'clock in the morning, you know, and sorting out the mail and then go around, you know, that could be quite hard in the winter in Norway, you know, freezing. Maybe people don't believe me, but I, I was a Manchester United fan when I was young, and obviously followed Lou McCarty and Steve, Steve Koppel, Gold McQueen and, you know, Gary Bale and Gold, you know, he was one of my heroes. So um, every Saturday in Norway, you know, they, they show a Premier League game and uh, I was a Manchester United supporter. My brother was a Liverpool fan, so uh, we've been arguing a few Saturdays over the years. It was against Kosice in the Champions League. I think it was the first European game for, for United for me. And uh, yeah, it came quickly to me because I thought maybe call uh, the defender get something on it, but it didn't. So uh, I just brought it neatly down and scored. David Beckham with a free kick. And now gone. Goalkeeper struggling and in by Henning Burke. And his first goal for Manchester United. I used to play... Uh, in midfield and actually start off a right wing actually but I didn't last long so but I played most uh, most center half of my life here yeah. why didn't the right wing last long well I think it lasted a couple of months <laughs> <laughs> I scored a few though yeah. no I've never been a striker me but uh, I was a decent midfield player I think <laughs> if I'm in Norway it's got to be the, um, the Norwegian uh, goat cheese you know that's fantastic and in England I don't know, Jarlsberg, the Norwegian um, white cheese, it's all right. I won one draw at Old Trafford around Christmas and uh, we won a lot and uh, they got a corner, which never was a corner, I remember, clearly. And uh, Pete came up for the, um, for the corner, pushed away three of our players and uh, Palace had it back and I think Pauline scored. Look at the goalkeeper, Mark, he's, he's on the edge of the box, goal. has come up. Well, it happens all the time on the continent. You don't see it very often here. Pallister gets the header in. Flowers makes the save. And Paul Ince has put it away. I like my mum's uh, home-cooked uh, meatballs, uh, obviously with potatoes and sauce. That's, that's beautiful. I played for Blackburn and um, played against Manchester United then, obviously. And uh, I was sent off for fouling Lee Sharp. Obviously, I got the ball, which... Uh, Everybody can see on the on the video. The penalty decisions are ridiculous. The sending off is even worse. The worst player there. He wins the ball quite clearly. Down they go together. I mean, I can't believe that. I cannot believe it. I know I used to like Elvis Presley when I was younger. I don't know if I bought any of myself, but the first one I got from gifts from family was, was Elvis. Did you ever pose in front of the mirror with a hairbrush pretending you were Elvis? I might have done when I was uh, four years old, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We'd witnessed a fabulous, famous five in...